He was born with his cleft lip, crooked jaw, and one eye. She decided that that wouldn't look good for his her breeding business, so she was going to euthanize him or drop him off at a farm. My mom's co-worker was the one who actually heard about it. She's like, would you be interested in taking this kitten from this breeder so he doesn't get killed? As soon as I saw him, I fell in love right away. He was um, pretty skinny, so we um, got him gaining some weight and got him to the vet and made sure he was okay. I would say we bonded pretty much immediately. I could tell he was going to have a personality right away. <laughs> He's the man in charge. <laughs> um, he has a spunky personality. He loves to play, but yet at the same time, he's super sweet. So all his deformities, they are genetic, but they really don't slow him down at all. He ran a little crooked when he was a kitten. You'll see when he's running now, even as an adult, he'll kind of veer a little bit more towards the side with the eye. I would say his genetic problems don't really hold him back at all. There's tons of cats and dogs that have genetic mutations or genetic issues. Don't be afraid of like the one-eyed cat or the three-legged cat. Their personalities shine through and they just make the greatest of pets. They just have so much love to give to. If you're thinking about adding a little furry friend to your home, definitely adoption. And rescues are just overwhelmed. I would say first adopt, don't shop. He is a big source of joy for me. He gets me through tough days and um, gets me through happy days too. He just is always there. He's also very entertaining. <laughs> I can just watch him for the evening when he's playing or running around and he's just um, a great little companion. <laughs>